Howard. In our next community conversation, we are joined by the wonderful Katie Rogers, marketing manager for Live Arts. Hey there, Steve. All right, Casey, thank you. There is no business like show business. That's and right. Nothing quite like opening night, which is tonight at Live Arts. Yes. So give us a little sneak peek of what we're, what's coming on stage. All right, we are opening the Virginia premiere of Jez Butterworth's The River tonight. Um, it's opening in the Founders Theater, which is our smaller black box space, very intimate, very cool as an audience member because you are right up next to where the actors are performing. So um, it's kind of a mystery. It's a little bit spooky, a little bit haunting. You don't really know what's going on, what's coming next. It's going to be a really cool show as an audience member. I got to see it. I got to see a sneak peek of it and it's very cool. A and as a performer, I would imagine. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Oh yeah, the actors are having a lot of fun. Uh, that's good. And that, that usually shows through. Yes. And kind of gets the audience going. Oh yeah. All right, so this time of year, the live arts is actually getting ready for summer already. Yep. Let's talk about what kind of summer programs are we looking forward to? Well, we just announced our summer camps, which are super popular. Um, and so those are on sale now at livearts.org. We've got camps for all ages, kids and teens. We actually have some new offerings for teenagers, 14 to 17. So if you have a drama kid in your life, we want you to go check that out. Um, and, uh, and we just announced our teen summer musical, which is going to be Heather's, the musical oh, nice. based on the film. <laughs> yeah, a uh, cult classic movie. So that is a really fun musical. And uh, I think the teens are gonna, gonna love that. So uh, auditions to come for that, but we did announce the title. And then teens and drama go together on stage oh, yeah. or off stage. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Vindictive teenagers in Heather's. <laughs> Um, and it's not just kids and teens now, there are summer programs for adults as well. Yeah, so uh, we are going back to the Fringe Festival this summer in Edinburgh. So we take a group of volunteers to the Edinburgh Fringe Festival, which is the biggest, uh, the biggest theater festival in the world, um, later in the summer, July and August. And they act as a tech team to support the American, or the, I'm sorry, the American High School Theater Festival and the International College Theater Festival at the Edinburgh Fringe. So theater technicians, stage managers, that's who we bring. And uh, it's a pretty amazing experience. I've gotten to go to Scotland with live arts before and it's unforgettable. So it sounds spectacular. What, a, what an opportunity. Amazing. Yeah, it's like about two or three weeks that you spend working in Scotland for the wow. summer. All right. So if you're interested in the fringe team, which I am, except for the skills part, <laughs> right. um, what are the best steps for someone to take? Well, we, as you know, we have a, a festival coming up at Live Arts called Waterworks, right. um, and that is going to be a really good way to get your feet wet <laughs> at Waterworks. Nice. I see what you did there. Uh, with how a theater festival runs and the skills that you need, it's, it's pretty hectic, but so enjoyable and so rewarding to do a theater festival like this. Um, we're really excited about Waterworks, and we need a lot of support, a lot of hands to make it work. So I really encourage everyone to check out Waterworks at livearts.org, and that would be a good little baby step toward going to the fringe. Nothing quite like good hectic. That's right, great, that right, a, that's, that's theater. That's one of the great combinations. That is, that's everything <laughs> in show business. <laughs> true, true. <laughs> Appreciate it as always, Katie, thank of you. Of course. Right, Casey.